Um, hey, what's up guys, I'm Callum here. Today I'm going to show you how to infect certain computers and um, how to bypass others. So first, I'm going to start off with bypassing computers. So, stick your floppy disk in there. Edit. Disk. Slash startup. Then what you want to do in here, if you're just going to bypass it, you just want to put something like print. Bypassed. By. Me. Just reload that. We know it works because it's there. So here we have a computer. I have forgot the password. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Oh no, it's just locked me out. What am I ever going to do? So if I put my floppy disk in there, let me load that. Bypassed by me. Edit start up. I mean. Edit, start up. Sorry, I'm horrible at typing. Oh, look, the password was potato. Oh, yeah, you see, there's some top line of code here. Basically, that means that you cannot use Control T. I'm putting it like that for a reason. Well, not really a reason, just felt like doing it. Well, the next thing is how to corrupt someone's computer. Use, um, can like change people's passwords if you've got this bypass disk as well. It's really useful. So again we're just gonna edit um disk slash startup. And instead of having that we're just gonna put um sleep seven thousand two hundred two minutes two hours sorry not minutes and OS dot shut down So let's just put that in there. Sorry about the fan. It's horrible. Let's just refresh that. Look, it, it's not going to respond. That's just going to like still up for two hours and then it's just going to reset. But that's fairly easy to, you know, avoid because you could just like replace the floppy disk and then put your own in. So instead of that, wait, can I use the quality? No, I can't. Instead of that, I would advise you just to make another bypass disk. Pro. I know that works. Stick that in there. That's what she said. Um. So it just says pro edit starter. So what was it doing? Ah, right. Yeah, so now here, instead of having all these lines of code, instead what you meant to do, just delete it all. Doesn't matter, it's not yours. <laughs> well, it's there, so uh, hopefully you hate the person you're doing this to, otherwise they're going to get pretty mad with you. So now you've deleted all that, you can use Control T, so now you can just use Slee. 7200. Oh, I've shut down. Just to make it even worse, so they can't use it. What we're gonna put is we're gonna put um OS dot hmm oh, I forgot what it was like no I just, I just need to undo it edit start up ah OS dot pull event raw so I, I'm just gonna delete that all sorry I didn't prepare for this video. So now I'm just going to put Slee, 7200, OS start shut down. So any data that they've got on their computer, they are forced to delete, because look, you cannot control T it. Look what's happened. Hmm. Ah, yes, yes. I know. So then you take your disc out. Re reload that. And then it's all crashed. Like, there's nothing you can do. You can't control T it. The only way you could really do it is by putting your own disc in it. The 
by then, like, you could just go through the computer and then use it as a hit list just to delete everything. So, is there anything else I need to tell you guys? Um, no, I don't think there is. So, that concludes this video, guys. Comment, rate, subscribe. Thanks for watching, and bye.